Hello everybody, Dripping Sister here and the Striking Viking. <laughs> so we are about five minutes from our destination um, in Squamish, British Columbia. And we hope to be able to get the same spot that we had last year um, and get settled in so that we can uh, go tomorrow over to the condo and see what needs to be done over there to get it ready for the next tenant. I did want to give you guys an update on the water heater. Oh. Now, strangely enough, we strangely. turned on the hot water and there was actually hot water. Strangely I was fiction. scratching my head because we did absolutely nothing. We did nope. nothing but nope. but pull out <laughs> yep. of the RV park where we were and head down the road. And at our stop uh, the next morning, I, I turned on the water, reached for the hot water by habit, and the water started getting warm. Well, Mr. Viking was outside doing something, and I'm standing there in utter shock because we had done absolutely nothing, had spent all that time on the phone with two technicians trying to get the thing sorted hours, out. Hours. hours and hours and hours trying to get it sorted out and could not get it sorted out. So it was just crazy. I don't I, I, I can't explain it. He can't explain it. No, they had us changing the plumbing around and they testing this and checking that and all kinds of other foolishness. And we, the sister turned the water on, and her eyebrows went up, and then her eyebrows went down, and hot water started coming out of the tap. She said, there's hot water. I said, what? <laughs> <laughs> she said, there's hot water. I said, no. She said, yes. So I went in and tried it for myself. I turned on the tap, and hot water started yeah, coming out. And it's still coming out. And it's still coming out. We've used it several several times since shower i had a shower last night and that's one thing i want to tell you about when you are in your rv in the walmart parking lot you could be showering and all of them people driving around they don't know <laughs> nothing about it you can have yourself a nice hot shower anyway and it's hot 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 it is hot we, want we to have turn to turn it, it down. down it's that it's that hot so we're we're very pleased that the situation has resolved and we will probably be talking to the guy tomorrow and tell him, hey, it's working. So there you go. Yeah, we'll just, um, sorry about the bumping around. We're going around a lot of corners pretty quick here. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I don't know. Uh, uh, they were, the uh, manufacturer was prepared for us to go on their website and find a authorized service center. They was going to ship another unit and have the service center put it in and all that good stuff and now it's like wow we just told them we didn't tell them yet that it was working because i thought maybe it's a fluke maybe this thing's just yeah. gonna turn off because it worked before for like five weeks and then it just shut off it just stopped working so we thought well you know maybe we'll wait and see how long it works uh but we'll we told him we would contact him next week said we're traveling right now we'll have to contact you after the weekend so we'll get in contact with him sometime this week i mean and let him know listen we don't know what happened we didn't do anything except leave the park we got to a remote place and the thing started working so we'll see how long it works if there's any problems we know we have a year uh warranty with the manufacturer and a three-year extended warranty so if we have problems with it we'll let them know Anyhow, just wanted to update you on that. We are almost home. And uh, it's been a good couple days trip and all that. Thanks for riding with us. And we'll see you on the upside. Keep tripping.